I uh, grew up in England, in the UK. I went to university in Scotland. Uh, I've spent different periods of my life in different countries. I first came to Ahmedabad in, I think it must have been 1996 or 1997. Uh, on a research trip for a book I was writing called Liberty or Death about the, uh, the Indian freedom movement. Uh, and I then returned, uh, you know, 20, 30 years later in order to, to do this job. And so one of the things that's very nice for us at Ahmedabad University is that although almost all of the faculty uh, come from India, a lot of them have been trained in different education systems. So I have colleagues in the School of Arts and Sciences who might have done their degrees, uh, sorry, their PhD degrees uh, in the US at uh, Columbia or at Berkeley or University of Pennsylvania, or they might have done it in the uh, UK at Cambridge or at Imperial University of London. Uh, some colleagues who've uh, been trained at good universities in the Netherlands at Leiden or in Canada at McGill and so what we have done in, in building the School of Arts and Sciences is that we've tried to take the best of uh, the Indian education system or higher education system and then join it with the best of other educational systems uh, in North America, in Europe, to an extent also from uh, places like Singapore, China. So it's very much a kind of global idea of what higher education can become where we're not wedded wholly to one system. Uh, we've got some elements of many different countries trying to create a 21st century model of what a university can be.